Hey Sentinels, welcome to this week's episode of SCTV. We have an exciting week ahead of us as this year's hashtag SCP HOCO week unfolds. Here's the layout of the week's themes and appropriate attire. Monday is social media day, wear blue for Twitter, yellow for Snapchat, brown for Instagram, and red and white for Pinterest. Tuesday is fandom, so dress as your favorite band or character. Wednesday will be in full uniform for masks, but the next day we'll have Throwback Thursday. Just like you dressed in junior high, represent an era, or personify a beloved childhood memory. Don't miss the variety show that night at 7 p.m. in the theater. Top off the week with Friday's Spirit Day with the homecoming game against the Vista Grande Spartans. Fortunately, the J. Cole concert was canceled, leaving more room for the homecoming dance on Saturday night, complete with food and dessert trucks and Mrs. Grindy's ruler. The fall play will open October 8th. If you're interested in being a part of the tech crew, Mrs. O'Neill will host a meeting in her room, 202, on Thursday, September 24th. Don't forget to buy tickets to the Fall Dance and Choir Fine Arts Night that will be on October 1st. Here's Ben Leach with a special interview. This week on SCTV Interview, I'm going in-depth with two of our new seating faculty. Let's go! Uh, I've been teaching now for well, 20 years, but uh, before I came here, I was teaching at Queen Creek High School. I was teaching American government, uh, and prior to that, I was teaching at, uh, I've taught at several schools, and I've taught just about everything in social studies, American history, world history, uh, sociology, psychology, government, economics, you name it, I probably taught it. Uh, well, I went to Seton from 2004 to 2008. And then after Seton, I went to ASU, got my degree in art education and sustainability. Um, and then after that, I worked at the Children's Museum in downtown Phoenix teaching classes there. And then after that, I worked at an art gallery in downtown Scottsdale. Don't fall behind. That's usually what most students have issues with. They don't keep up with work, they fall behind in work, and they find themselves in a lot of trouble at the end trying to catch up, and that's just not gonna work, it doesn't help you. I would say just give it your best effort. You know, I believe that creativity is something that everyone has and is born with and it's a God-given gift and it's up to us to take that gift and to work with it and to just put in as much effort as you would any other class. It just takes more practice, just like math, English, science, any other subject. It just takes time. I would like to be invisible. Yes, I would like to be invisible. That way I could sit and watch people do all kinds of crazy things all day long and they would never know I was laughing at them. I would like the ability to breathe underwater because I'm a huge scuba diving nerd and I would love to get certified and be able to swim with the whales and the dolphins and the fish. Um, so I would like to be able to breathe underwater as well as talk to the animals. That would be great too. <laughs> Hey, uh, Gallant. Uh, Coach Gallant. Coach Gallant. You say, that's 26 right now. Give oh, me 26. Uh, Let's go. Well, get on the ground. It's funny you Come say on. that, actually. We were going to wonder, we were wondering if we could get big by homecoming. Get big by homecoming. If you could help yeah, us. That's yeah. possible. Really? It's possible. You'll help us? Yeah, I will. I'll help you. Okay. Well, cool. uh, get it done. Get it done, Coach sir. Coach Gallant. Sir. Thank you. All right, so I guess we're going to want to start with one of the, uh, probably just, this looks like a good one to, uh, random, wait. It's just like a down and an up? That's a push-up. Okay. Down and up. I'll do one of each. Andy and Justin are doing great. Making great progress. Hey, come on, we're only at five. Five. Is it only five? They're working hard every day. How did you I don't know. But I don't know. Their goal is to get swole for homecoming. See, I want to try to work on this part. Yeah. That way, when I if I when I flex, it comes. It's a bigger bump. Get this to be bigger. That doesn't get that's a bone. Oh. I believe in them. It's a huge project. Hopefully, we can attain the goal. 
I believe in you guys. Hey, ladies. Hey, who wants to take us to homecoming? Notice, notice anything different about us? You look at our arms? <laughs>